in Vienna, Austria, and I'm so excited. I'm going to the Schon Schonbrunn Palace today. I'm alone, but it's okay because I just want to be alone today because I really just want to see and I just want to be like one-on-one -on -one with the palace. I'm going to take the tram and the subway. So I'm walking to the tram. The tram is one block away and then from there I'm gonna light after two stops and take the subway going to the palace. I'm wearing my four inch boots, yung killer boots ko. If you can see. And I'm gonna do a lot of walking and I forgot my winter socks so I'm just wearing regular socks. <laughs> Whatever. I was supposed to, to take an Uber because I was super tamad, but I'm like, where is the Nina that wants to feel like a local? So I'm taking the public transport now. As if it's Uber, it's like 17 minutes away and I don't have a lot of time to so. And I want to vlog in the car, but let's just take the transport so I'm feeling local. Welcome to Vienna! Ryan Little. <laughs> So guys, I was going to buy the ticket to the tram, pero para ang complicated. I mean, not really complicated, but I forgot the station I have to buy. Kasi sabi lang sa akin 71, but hindi, dapat kasi I know the station kung saan ako bababa. But anyway, whatever. Kasi if I take the tram and take the subway, it will take more time. And I have to be there as soon as possible because it's... It closes at 5 p.m. and sunset is at 4.07 and it's already 2 2.20 so I'm just waiting for my Uber. Wala na it's only like 14 euros, so it's fine. Kasi naman wala akong madatnan, di ba? And I don't want to walk anymore because I'm wearing heels and for sure, puro walk yung gagawin ko dun sa palace. Now, I am on my way to Sean I'm in an Uber and I wore na my jewelry because I didn't have time to wear them. Ryan Say Mitchell. hi! <laughs> Muhammad. Hi. Hello. <laughs> and have a great day! See ya in Izmir, okay? <laughs> Okay, let me just get my bag and I'll be off. Oh. Oops, my hat. Thank you. Bye bye. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I'm excited. Okay, I have like two hours to go all over the palace. So, and there are not a lot of people. Ito yung maganda kapag winter season because people don't wanna go out during the winter because it's too cold. And I forgot my scarf, but it's okay because parang init ng suot ko. Pero this is just two layers. I don't know why. So, let's go! Okay, so now I am going to buy tickets. There was a girl who approached me and said, Excuse me, are you from France? I was like, huh? I know I'm from the Philippines. And then she said, No, because it's your hat and you're like, war, like your style. I'm like, oh, thank you. <laughs> so anyway, that's the palace and I'm going to buy tickets. Well, I am here lined up for the tickets there. And there are five kinds of tickets imperial tour grand tour sissy ticket family pass winter pass is it sissy i don't know sissy sissy ticket it's just so stupid right now okay guys now i am so ready to go although i don't know where I should go but I've bought a ticket already so actually for the time that I'm gonna spend here the perfect one is the Grand Tour which is the one that I got it's for 20 euros okay I should go to gate A because I said like can I get the Grand Tour and the Imperial Tour and then she said the Imperial Tour is included in the Grand Tour so okay lang because in the other tours you should spend a day. So this is the best tour for me and I'm so happy. I'm really sad and everything. This is the palace. Hi. And it's Christmas time. So let me take you on the tour. And they 
we've also put up the Christmas market booths. Yay! So let's go later. Let's have hot wine. Now I'm going inside. So if you want to leave your things or your jackets or whatever, they have a cloak room here, but I didn't leave my things anymore. Pero dito rin yung exit. I didn't leave my things anymore because parang naawa ako dun sa lalaki. Parang dami niyang naasikaso. And I'm not sure if lalabas kami for the tour. It might be cold, so I might regret not bringing my jacket. So, oh my gosh! I want that! I'm going to gate A for the tour. Wow, oh my god. Ang ganda! Oh my gosh! Look at this. I don't know if it would do justice, but... See, see that? It's so nice to see from here. Anyway, for sure we will go there later. I'm so excited to tour you guys! Yay! And here's my echo back. See ya! Sadly, so they have a free audio guide. I'm so happy. It's my first time to use this. Ah! No videos. Okay. Do you yes. Want, yes. Please do. But where should, where can we take? Outside. Here inside. No picture. No pictures. Okay. Hi everybody. Oh my gosh, it's cold now. I am done with the tour. Oh my gosh, super ganda. And I learned a lot of things. Like I got chills this one time. Because the I was. Uh, by the way, I'm so sorry that I don't have any clips inside because we're not allowed to take pictures or vlog or whatever so i just wanted to respect that so i have nothing at all except for the clips that i took accidentally because i i wasn't able to turn off my camera kasi nga parang okay uh, kasi nakita ko agad yung sign and then they approached me agad na we can take a picture here i bought the book and it has pictures of the room so i can show you and i i bought a magnet and the book Grabe yung history of the Shun, Shunbrun pala. Di pala Shun. Shunbrun Palace. See, this is the Christmas market. Yay! I am going to the other side of the palace. Mas gusto ko siya kaysa itong front yard, courtyard, whatever you call this. I wanna see the garden. Kasi yun yung alam ko may parang garden na magkakita. Anyway. I got chills kanina. I was listening to the audio guide. I entered this room and then sabi din sa audio guide, this room is where Mozart's first concert was held, like when he was six years old. And I got chills like, oh my god, the, the room where I'm in, Mozart was also here. I'm like, oh my gosh. Oh, I just got chills. I'm trying to, sakit na pa ako, but I'm gonna go because I have to go all the way. Oh, it's so cute. And I'm gonna take pictures. Because I have to go all the way to the back to see the garden. I really, really love it. I saw it from Wawaho. I saw it from there. Oh my god, look, it's so Christmassy. Wait, I'll take a photo here. Okay, so what else did I learn today? I learned that their national dish is schnitzel. Very, very common. I learned that the family is very... They're, they were very talented, like the kids, and, and they would usually marry just for the continuation of the dynasty or for political reasons, so that they wouldn't wage war. Nina naman ako focus. Nina naman ako focus. Maria Teresa's. So when I was a child, I forgot how many. I think 16. And she had one favorite daughter, si Maria Christine, and she was the only one was allowed to marry for love. All the rest of her children were married for political reasons. Their style is the Rococo style and there were even rooms that had like Chinese um, decorations or Chinese influence and I think a little bit Japanese. My mind is like all jumbled from all the amazing things I saw today like super fabulous magnificent royalty. Like when I was in this like ballroom I felt like Oh my gosh, royalties walked here on the same floor that I'm walking on. And I feel like royalty. Just kidding. So anyway, we're now going to the garden. And 
and the place is like very very vast it's like a really really big lot tapos nalagyan ng pala sa gitna tapos unahan may like receiving whatever and then sa likod may garden pero like super lake if you've been to the Marcos Palace malakan yang parang nagirest ko grabe pala talaga yung what they did the like the house that they built because it levels with come on imperial royalty like you know the inlay na mga gold ganyan kuno na ganun wow ito talaga yung nakapagpawaw sa akin pero sobrang layo tingnan mo look how far it is and i'm gonna go there see look how far it is let's go there guys pupunta muna ako doon wait it's so dark i'm gonna go up the stairs there because there's that garden thingy. Unfortunately, it's not a labyrinth. I really, really want to see a labyrinth. Oh my God, ang dilim na. I have to come back. I really want to bring my family. Because you know what? Like, I really, really love going to museums. Like, for me, a perfect date would be like going to a museum and then eating in Binondo or whatever. I don't know. Like, I just want to. I just like going to the muse to museums, especially interactive ones. So, or like, alam mo yung mga field trip and then going to Rizal's house. I super love ko yun. So anyway, I just really, really enjoyed today. And I'm so happy. Kahit I'm alone. Because usually, if I'm with a group of people, they don't like going to museums. They just want to take photos. And I really don't like... I mean, I love taking photos, of course. But I also like learning things and like learning about the place I'm exploring. Okay, so... Ito na siya. Because it's so far and I think I'm gonna get tired but on the I like on the brighter side of my mind I'm like minsan ka lang nandito but hindi ka papupunta but ka kasi nag heels so anyway let's go there and I'm super hungry I really want to buy a schnitzel and a hot wine but I should stop drinking alcohol at saka kasi yung, yung lalakaran gravel ano ba yan? Oh my god, Sean Burn, you can do better than this. Why is it not, I know. Why is there not grass? Why is there gravel? So that is Sean Burn. This is the back of the palace. Let me see if I can take a photo here and block all the other ones for taking photos. Just kidding. <laughs> Okay guys, I am finally here and I know it's so dark. See that? Okay. It's freaking perched on top of a hill and I didn't realize. But it's so nice because from here you can see the view of maybe the whole city or maybe half of the city of um, Vienna and it's like really 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 nice. And I could imagine it in the morning. And imagine ha, kung gano yung nag mga nagdo-jog dito yung trail nila. So get, ito yung parang elevated trail nila. So imagine inakit ko to in heels. My gosh. So I'm really sorry it's so dark. Um wait, let me light up my face with my phone. My god, di pa ako makain. Um So there. Oh, hi. So um so I made it to the top and it's really nice because right across it as in like same is the palace and then even the color is like the palace's color even the shape like or like the length it's just like a skeleton of the of the palace it's so nice wait let me show you my face so let's go down and have a schnitzel or whatever to eat at the Christmas market, I hope they still have. Um, wait lang. Bato bagi naga nito. 
Para namang flashlight. Uh, because people are gonna see me, like, see me. Oh, wait. Let's hope that they still have food there because I have to eat. I'm so hungry. And I like to talk to you guys. Oh my god. And make cuento. But before anything else, before I get sprained, I will go down safely. Okay? See ya. the Christmas market since it's a Christmas market we want stores or whatever they only accept cash and I don't have cash like right once voila so sadly I have to go back to the hotel and I'm tired anyway and I'm leaving tomorrow so next time then and I hope next time I'm with my family and by the way hello to my family because they always watch my YouTube videos or always watch my vlogs Hello, Mommy, Daddy, Blinky, Victor, and Adin Adin. It's so fun. And Mita, and Tita Sally, and Tita Vlad, and all the rest, and the rest of my relatives. Thank you so much for being my number one supporters. Oh my gosh, we're going on. But I'm just really, really happy. And I really, really wish you are all here with me. It's really, I think Vienna is very nice to go to with family. I'm gonna try to look for Wi-Fi. I have my Pokefy with me but for some I topped it up but for some reason it's not working. I hope I can connect to the Wi-Fi somewhere. I need to focus but I'm looking forward to like talking to you guys because I know I've been MIA for like more than a month and a lot of things happened and uh, I might or might not share it. We'll see. I'm just so happy I'm vlogging again. I just hope I find the time and find the motivation to make the time to edit my vlog. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed our Vienna vlog and I hope to see you again soon. Don't, please don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel. Para naman happy tayo and I know that you know, I'm making other people happy and then maybe somehow inspiring people to travel or share share their lives i look forward to meeting you or like even and even virtually okay guys i'm so happy with na lang my wi-fi so i'm just waiting for my uber and i'm sorry we don't have a lot of clips today i really thought i could vlog inside but apparently sean brood wants you to come here and see it for yourself so I'll just show you pictures or you can Google them, but it's really nice. But it's even nicer when you appreciate it. Kapag I, I either get a tour guide, like your personal tour tour guide or the audio guide. Actually, I didn't know you can have a personal tour guide. I was with a couple and then they had a personal tour guide. I mean, I, I wanted one, but kasi mas maraming information na binibigay yun, diba? But anyway, it's okay. Next time when I'm with my family, I'll get for us. So there, sadly, it is my last night in Vienna and I'm leaving tomorrow, so I hope next time I can explore it more because I think it's a really beautiful city and it has a lot of history, like it's very rich in history and I would love to read up on it, but next time I come here I would appreciate it so much more. And hopefully next time I will be with my family. I would love to take them here. So, ayun lang and I'll see you next time. Hello guys, so I am here at the hotel. I'm going to eat. I'm super tired, like my feet are sore, but I but it's okay. Um, I'm the only one here at the restaurant and the server, Sophie, she's so 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 nice. She's like so eager to to serve me and everything. She gave me this because they only give this to VIPs but she gave it to me because she said it's so nice but she she's super nice but I cannot drink it it's 60% alcohol and I have work tomorrow morning so I cannot it's um what time is it now it's 6.28 now and yeah I cannot drink it but she, like the way she described it is like it's like fire with fruit because it's um it's flavored like plum Imagine it's almost absinthe. It's sixty percent alcohol, but you cannot. But thank you, Sophie, for giving this to me because I feel so special because you gave this to me. So 
and I ordered schnitzel and her recommendation of beef tartar for appetizer. I actually wanted a hot appetizer but she recommended a cold one so I would go for her recommendation because I trust her. And she really tells me which ones are the good ones or not. So, okay, so I'll show you. Actually, schnitzel is just like fried chicken. It's like para um, boneless chicken na malaki, na fried in fat. That's it. But I don't know why it's there. Um, it's very famous in Vienna and in Germany. Sophie! Hello! Yay! Welcome to Vienna! Yay! It's me! So, you. this is called Gedek. Okay. It's special from here, from Vienna. And it's coming the bread with special nuts and the uh, Vulcan mm -hmm. sauce, normal white sauce, and butter. But this, this is a salt, normal salt. It's normal, this one yes. Himalayan, and this is the Vulcan. A Vulcan, wow. And, and the butter. butter, yes. I will try. Thank you. You're so welcome. Nice. Oh my gosh, I'm so lucky tonight. Oh, <laughs> thank you. the restaurant for Yeah, thank you so you much. If I take a video, I want to. <laughs> no, okay, thank you so much. You're welcome. Okay, so I learned from Sophie that the Bon Appetit in German is called Guten Appetit. And we will eat this. I don't know how to eat this because there's... Oh, it's warm. Yay. I don't know. Like, do you put the... Okay, let's try it with the butter first. Okay, kasi baka maiti na. Kasi diba ito yung recommendation niya. Hindi ko alam na hilaw pala ang tartar. So, it's hilaw na itlog at hilaw na baka. Oh my god. Anyway. Daddy, I'm gonna try it. Mm. Ah. So, like, how do you eat this? It's like, you just... Tartar steak. Okay. But I think it's good because it's raw. Let me try it. Mm. Mm, it's okay. Okay lang. Ano to eh? Appetizer. Mmm, sarap ng salad. No, I don't want your love. Don't come to me now. I don't want your love. Don't come to me. It's really tender because it's rare and it's really good when you mix it with the rocket rocket layers or the arugula. Guys, I was talking, I'm still talking to my dad, right? And then I was eating the raw beef and then my dad was like, Okay, so tapos ka I said, yeah. And then, sabi niya, okay, so now I can comment on it. Sabi ko, ano, tatagaluin ko na no, kasi recommendation to nung nag, uh, nagbigay sa akin ng pagkain. Ayoko naman na marinig niya na like, ay mga komento ako. Um, sabi ng daddy ko, so now I can comment about it. Alam mo, di ko kaya kainin yan, sabi niya. Sabi ko talaga, bakit? Like, sa totoo lang, nung first bite ko, kasi yung, yung hilaw lang na, uula, na karne yung kinain ko, syempre parang nakakasuka. Kasi, imagine mo sashimi na beef, ganun. Pero, Nung nag contrast na siya against the arugula and the and the bread and all the all these components, it's really good. Pero hindi ko siya order din ulit. Pero sabi ko kay daddy, but I'm proud. I mean, now I know that I can eat it. So at least an, it's an experience, right? As long as hindi sa sakit ko siya ng okay lang. But it's okay. It's good, and I really love arugula, so it's really good. Yay! So guys, this is the famous schnitzel. Actually, it's also famous in Germany, and it's breaded schnitzel, and it's also here. It's one of one of the most famous dishes in Vienna, and you should try it. So we're gonna eat schnitzel. 
Look, Daddy, it's a heart. Heart. Oh, nga eh. Sorry. Sorry. I don't usually hold my, like, touch my food, but it's a heart. It's an exception. Okay, yo. Sweet cranberry sauce, my favorite. It's really good. 